Before we get started with today's episode, I'm so excited to share Families Fly Free is open again after being closed all summer. So we are now accepting new members and in celebration, we are offering a limited time discount, which is the best price of the year, plus a bonus of Southwest points when you join. If you paid expensive airfares this summer, never again. If you have dabbled in travel rewards but feel overwhelmed or are turned off by the idea of having a whole bunch of travel cards in your wallet, no worries. Come learn the simplest, most popular system in existence for using travel rewards to fly for free, supported by our team of experts. It's time to make more travel memories with your family and do it at less than the cost of one round trip for your group. Learn more by going to familiesflyfree.com slash join and take advantage of our special limited time offer, the best deal of the year before it goes away. Do you love to travel and save money? Or do you wish you could travel but money is holding you back? you're in the right place. Welcome to the Families Fly Free podcast, where I show you how to fly your family free forever using my simple fly free formula. I'm your host, Lynn Mettler. My family of four has mastered the art of flying free as simply as possible since 2015, and I want to show your family how to do it too. Welcome everyone, and thanks for joining me today for the Families Fly Free podcast. I'm excited to share with you today that after closing enrollment all summer, so we could work on some special projects and new features, Families Fly Free is now open to new members. And so in celebration of that, we are offering the best deal we've had all year to join Families Fly Free, but it's only available for a very short time. So if you're interested in learning more and getting started, please visit familiesflyfree.com join soon. Now today we're going to be talking about one of the things you will be learning as a Families Fly Free member, and that is my Fly Free formula. See if you can say that fast three times. We have lots of Fs with Families Fly Free, Fly Free formula, um, but I'm going to reveal to you my Fly Free formula today. My Fly Free formula is what sets our methods apart from anyone else in the world of travel rewards. Nobody else teaches you a process. They simply give you all of the many options, which leaves many of you overwhelmed, and they just let you take a stab at trying to cobble together an approach. And that is in fact how I started in travel rewards as well. I learned about this concept, I did lots of research, as I'm sure many of you have, and I sort of just stumbled my way through what to do. Um, And I made plenty of mistakes along the way, which I have shared um, in many previous episodes. But I was determined to figure out a way to make this all work because I could see it was amazing. And I wanted a way that it could work, but not be difficult or take a ton of time. And lo and behold, I did indeed figure it out. I really love to take complicated topics and make them simple. And I've done that all through my career for all kinds of different subjects. And so that's exactly what I've done for travel rewards. I think that comes from... Um, being a writer, you have to learn how to take a complicated subject and make it approachable, understandable to anyone. So I put together a process that kept my family with enough miles and points in our accounts to always be able to fly for free within the U.S. and Europe. Those have been our primary goals for travel. And it's incredibly simple. 
It doesn't involve a whole bunch of travel cards in your wallet or churning cards. You don't have to be doing any churning, opening, closing of cards all the time. There is a different, better approach to travel rewards that actually works better than card churning and a bunch of cards. And better yet, it works for entire families. And that was also very important to me to figure out. I didn't want something that would just allow me or just my husband and I to jet set around the world. I wanted to take my kids with us and I wanted to take them all over the place. I want all of us to see um, as all the places that we want to see. So that's what I'm going to share with you today. The steps of my fly free formula. And if after hearing it, you want some support, personal help, implementing it from a team of experts who do this day in and day out with hundreds of people offering hands down the best service in travel, then come and join us in Families Fly Free and you might as well do it right now while we're offering the best price of the year. Okay, are you ready to learn my Fly Free formula? Here we go. The first part is just simply understanding that you do not have to pay for flights in order to earn frequent flyer miles. So a lot of you may know that already, but there may be some of you who are brand new to this concept and you still are in the mindset of, well, I know that I can earn travel rewards, but don't I have to pay for a lot of flights to get them to start with? And you don't. So there are tons of other ways to earn miles and points. Um, and I think that's something that the general population does not understand, um, that there, you don't have to spend any money that you were not planning to spend already um, in order to earn these miles and points. And you certainly don't ever even have to step foot on a plane. Um, and so some of these ways um, do include selectively using travel credit cards. So the second thing that I recommend as part of my fly free formula is that you make Southwest Airlines your primary airline that you fly within the US and the Caribbean. Now, you can fly another airline here or there following my formula, but we recommend that Southwest be your primary airline and that you try to stick to them as much as possible. And this is because the way that they set up their frequent flyer program, their loyalty program, makes it so much easier to travel a lot of places and bring a lot of people with you compared to any other major airline out there. And even though they are considered a discount airline, they don't act like one. So you're gonna experience really good service from them. You're not gonna experience the service of Spirit or Frontier. They are a class act. 99% um, of the time, they handle any problems that you would experience with them very well. And they are a pleasure to fly. And they offer a lot of benefits that people don't realize, like you can bring two free checked bags per person. They recently added um, that you can now put yourself on a standby list for an earlier flight that day, no matter what fare type you buy with them. We always recommend buying the cheapest fare type, um, which doesn't often come with as many perks, but now you can also try to get on standby for an earlier flight if you want to. They never charge you any fees when you cancel a flight or change a flight. So for families in particular, that gives you a lot of peace of mind that you can cancel things, you can move things around as things come up as they do when you have a growing family or a young family or you're caring for aging parents. So that's step number two, fly Southwest Airlines. And then step number three, which is related, is you want to always hold a Southwest Companion Pass. And the Southwest Companion Pass is a pass that you can earn by um, currently, and this might change if you're listening to this in the future, you have to earn 135,000 points in one calendar year. Um, and if you can earn that, and we have a very simple way that we show you how 
anyone can earn the Southwest Companion Pass. Um, one member of your family always flies for free. So that means they don't have to pay any cash. They don't have to pay any points either to fly. They do pay the $5.60 mandatory security fee per way, but that's it. And they can fly free with you for as many times as you want to bring them while that pass is valid. And the pass is good from the time you earn it until the end of the following year, not the current year, but the following year. So it can last as long as up to two years, just depending on when you earn it. So I think you can see that's a tremendous benefit. That's a point saver. It saves you cash. If every single time you're flying Southwest, one of you doesn't have to pay anything. There's no better savings than that. So that's why that's a key part of my fly free formula. And we say always have a Southwest companion pass. And so we teach you how to earn it and then keep earning it every two years to get on a system that's very easy. You don't have to spend $135,000 or even $60,000 to earn this pass, you don't have to fly 25 flights a year um, and you don't have to re-earn it every year. There's a much simpler way to do it that we teach you. And so my family always has a companion pass um, and that's a big key to being able to fly for free. Number four is to put your everyday spending on a flexible travel card. So your everyday spending means things like your utility bills, your gas, your groceries, um, going to the drugstore, um, any you know daycare, uh, tuition, um, any kind of expense that you have to pay anyway. You want to choose a card that's going to earn you points that you can use for free travel. And um, a shift here for most of you is to stop. You may have realized this concept of I should put my spending on a travel card to at least earn miles and points. But a lot of you are putting it on an airline card. Maybe you've been flying Delta for eons and so you've got your Delta card and you just use that or United or American or even Southwest. We don't recommend you put your everyday spending on any airline card. We love Southwest but don't use the card that way because then you're only earning miles in that program. It's better than earning nothing for sure. But, um, and so you can't, those miles are not flexible. And usually an airline card does only is going to give you one mile, one point per dollar, unless you're spending with that airline, which you shouldn't be because we're, you're, learning how to not have to pay for airfare um, in dollars. You're going to use points instead. So by shifting your spending to a flexible card, and these can be programs like the Chase Ultimate Rewards Program, the Capital One Venture Rewards Program, the City Thank You Points Program, or the Amex um, Membership Rewards Program, um, these are all examples of flexible cards that um, allow you to earn more points per dollar in different categories of spending. And then those points can be used flexibly. So they can be used, um, they're going to vary with each card system, but they can be used usually for a variety of different airlines and hotels and maybe even for other travel expenses like car rentals or theme park tickets and in some cases even vacation rentals. Um, and even transportation like taxis and subways and that kind of thing. Um, so if you can make that shift, that's a key way that we avoid card churning by simply picking the correct card to put your everyday spending on, you will earn double and triple the points in some, in some categories, um, in some big categories of spending. And then you'll have points that you can use wherever you need them instead of just being locked into one particular company, airline, hotel system. Um, all right, number five is, and this is a big one that most, you don't hear this elsewhere typically, um, is to learn how to pay fewer points per flight. 
Um, and we do talk in Families Fly Free about staying free in hotels and vacation rentals. Um, and so it applies to that too. But with the Fly Free formula, we're gonna show you how to minimize the number of points you're spending to book. And we're particularly, Southwest particularly allows you to do a lot of different things to pay fewer points per flight. Uh, but you can also do that when flying to Europe. And so if you can understand, um, we've talked about, you know, yes, you want to be collecting points and you want to be replenishing those points with your everyday spending. And every two years, you're going to need a new Southwest Companion Pass. And so that's going to be another 135,000 points that you get. But if you can use those points efficiently and use as few as possible, that allows you to take more trips and bring more people with you. And that is key. You can't just spend the points with, you know, like, oh, I for sure want to fly Saturday to Saturday. I don't care what the points price is, you know, um, and just pay the published price. You're not going to get to go nearly as many places as that. You need to learn the tricks and hacks, the tricks of the trade, um, and all the insider hacks and tricks that we have to um, allow you to save not just in dollars, but on points. And so we have members who, you know, they have saved two and 300,000 points. I mean, we saved 300,000 points just on one flight um, at one point. Um, and so if you can learn this stuff, um, you, that's the key to being able to see a lot of places. And that's how we fly six times a year. The last one I want to mention as part of the fly free formula is um, when it comes to flying to Europe. So we've talked about Southwest and the US and the Caribbean, but um, we also teach you how to fly to Europe. And what we recommend is that you use flexible points to fly to Europe. So instead of trying to save up points in American or save up miles in, you know, United or Delta, and there's all the kind of things out there you can do like, you can save up Singapore Airlines miles and you can use them to book on United because it's fewer miles to do it that way. Um, but these things are very complicated and they're time consuming and you have to spend your time. There's only certain award seats available in that case and they're not available on every flight. And when they sell out, they sell out. So you have to be looking and looking and looking for award seats to be available on a flight that works for you. If you can shift your mindset instead to using a flexible point system, the ones we talked about, um, those in most cases allow you to book any airline on any flight to Europe. Europe. You can book a connection, you can book a nonstop, you can book a first class if you have the points, you can book economy, you can book um, you know, from any city to any city on any airline in most cases, you know, depending on what that system um, allows you to do. But that's a much simpler way to get yourself to Europe than trying to have a master's degree in every airline and which ones are partners and how do you book award seats and all of that. And we have found just using this simple system, our members have plenty of points to do what they want. Um, and so maybe they end up spending, you know, a few more points or miles to use flexible points Maybe they don't, but in some cases they might versus this Singapore Airlines United trick. Um, but they still have plenty of points to go wherever they want. So it doesn't matter that they're spending a little more. They saved a boatload of time and stress um, on top of that. And so that makes you more apt to continue down this path of travel rewards because it's simple and easy and it doesn't take you much time. It's not a pain in the butt. Um, and so you're going to keep at it and your family is going to see the benefits of that. So those are the basics of my fly free formula. So are you starting to see how flying for free can be simple and, and maybe how it's different than what you've been doing thus far? Like, can you open your mind to see there's a different way that could do to do this that could work? Um, or maybe you're someone like who's never done this before and you think it's too good to be true. So this gives you an idea of um, what the process is going to look like. Are you starting to see how you can do it with just a handful of cards um, and how you can keep replenishing your points balances month after month and year after year? So you always have points ready to go to fly for free. It's not just to earn a big chunk of points, spend them, and then you don't have any more. You're always getting more points in your account through your spending. Um, so now that I've outlined this process for you, um, I want you to know that to really execute this, 
you need to understand all the little details in between here. Um, so this is the big picture, but to execute it properly, you really have to understand the fine print, the rules, the details um, that go along with these various credit cards. Um, again, we're very selectively using cards, you know, three will um, fill out, you can do my process in full to fly for free with three. Um, but And you also want to understand the rules and regulations of the different loyalty programs and how you earn the Southwest Companion Pass. A lot of people think they know how to earn the Companion Pass, but they don't understand how to really maximize that and what the regular, how to um, play the regulations to the full. Because for example, Southwest, tends to phrase it as though you have to re-earn companion pass every year and you don't. You just have to earn it and then it's good through the end of the following year and then you have to earn it again for the next two years. So it's so much easier to earn it every two years than it is every single year. And a lot of people are just doing that by default. They haven't stopped to think that there's a different way. Um, so other examples would be, you know, the details of how you pay fewer points per flight. There's a lot of different ways that you can do it. And we have systematized all of this for you so that um, you will, when, if you join Families Fly Free, you'll get access to the video version of my Fly Free formula where you'll learn how to execute each step in detail. Um, and, and also how to fly free to Europe. We have sp very specific recommendations of how we think is the easiest step-by-step -step process to do that with flexible travel cards. So this is all where Families Fly Free comes in. Um, I really saw a need to support people going through this, to give them a process, but then not just to leave them alone. If this is not a one-sided dialogue where you come in and you take in information and you leave. This is a community and it's a constant exchange of information between our members and our team and even members to members. So we map out for you exactly how to execute each of these steps. So you know exactly what to do for each one. And then we are available to answer any and all questions you have, um, whether you like to send them via email via text. If you want to come on live with me, I host live Q and A's every single month for our members, our VIP members get their own live Q and A. Um, and you can ask your question live in real time and we can go back and forth in dialogue. Or you can ask the question in our community and hear from our hundreds of other members. We also teach you constant new information about travel every month if you want to learn more. Um, that's never a critical part of the process uh, to be able to fly for free, um, but if you want to keep learning and um, explore how to save on other parts of travel, we offer that to you via live webinars every month that are then recorded and you can watch the replays or listen via our members only podcast um, at any point in the future. We also keep you updated on the changing news and hacks that are going on in the world of travel. So like, for example, the sad and devastating fires in Maui. Um, so we're keeping, we have members who had planned a trip to Maui. And so we're helping them with, um, you know, is this, do they need to go even though they're not going to West Maui and, and how can they reschedule? What steps do they need to take? Um, those might be things that you don't think about um, when you're starting to learn about flying free, but when you start traveling all these places, you also need support on the travel side. Um, so we keep you updated with that kind of news and information, um, with sales, with great deals, with new card offers and whether they make sense. I just held, um, we just held our live Q and A last week and it was such a great one. So many members were on with great questions. And um, I talked through my thoughts on Southwest um, adding the same day standby option. They are also limiting early bird uh, seating. And that's a, a seating that you can buy ahead of time that gives you um, earlier check-in than, than, than everyone else. That means you can pick your seat before everyone else. And so I was able to give my analysis of um, 
of these things and whether I thought they were good or not and how to maximize them. And so that's the kind of stuff. Travel is always changing. The way these loyalty programs work is always changing. These travel cards are always changing. The hacks and the tricks change. Um, and so we keep on top of that for you. And we send you a weekly um, email and then um, you get a very digested couple sentence brief of what we think you need to know this week. Uh, via email or via mobile alert if you like to get information that way um, so that you can easily stay on top of this with just a glance through you know for four to five minutes to see if there's any information that relates to you um, there really is truly nothing like families fly free and that's why i created it i just saw a need for it um, and our members agree there they love it there's nothing out there like it if you want to hear what our members have to say about Families Fly Free, because that's who I want you to really hear from, is the people that are having success inside of the program. Um, if you want to hear from them how much they've been able to save, what they think our support is like, um, things like the unexpected benefits they've gotten from Families Fly Free and how they've been able to take the money they've saved and do other things, go to familiesflyfree.com slash video and you can watch a quick video that we have put together that's just our members sharing their experience. Um, so definitely give that a look at familiesflyfree.com slash video. And of course, if you want to learn more and get started as a member of Families Fly Free today, just head to familiesflyfree.com slash join and we would absolutely love to have you. All right, I hope you have a great week. If you're ready to fly your family free forever, I invite you to join my Families Fly Free membership. You'll learn how to stop paying for airfare throughout the US, Caribbean, and Europe so you can make those priceless family travel memories before your kids or even your grandkids leave home for good. And you'll learn it using my simple proven formula that's helped hundreds of families. Plus, it's risk-free. You either get your investment in the membership back in free travel, or I give you your money back. You can get more information at familiesflyfree.com slash join.